So guys, I am back with another Elden Ring video and today I showcase to you guys the location of what has to be the best looking armor in the entire game. It also comes with a shield. The weapon is a different story from a different video, uh, but hey, today I'll explain absolutely everything you need to know to look this good. How's it going guys? My name's DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so the weapon, let's start with that. This is called the Sword of Night, and it's a part of a very long quest line, which I've just covered. I posted a video about an hour and a half ago. The video is about 46 minutes long. It's Ymir and Yolan's quest line. Um, it's quite a good quest line as well, but if you want to check that out and get this incredible weapon, I'll link that video in the video description. But that is the matching weapon to this armor set, guys. So you're going to need it. It's a katana does some crazy ass things that's for sure uh unique skill witching hour slash which you just saw i mean check that out whoop, whoop, whoop. incredible incredible uh but in regards to the armor uh, there's also a shield that comes with it which i'll showcase to you guys how you get that today um actually fires out projectiles too check that out pretty cool so let's check a little quick look at the armor uh actually we do shield first so it's called the shield of night and it's got a unique skill, Revenge of the Night, unleashes a darker night imbued with magic power. If used immediately after blocking an incoming attack, its power is absorbed, boosting the strength of this skill. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. The armor has got no special traits to it. It just looks absolutely incredible. I don't think you will deny that. That is for sure. So the shield and the armor pieces um, are actually quite easy to get. So first things first, guys. If you haven't progress past uh, Castle Ensis, which means uh, you haven't beat Relena Twin Moon Knight, then there is a skip around because you want to get into this area here, particularly you want to come to around this spot, uh, but this is the very first grace you'll come to after defeating uh, Relena outside of Castle Ensis, uh, which will be right there, so we're going to go there guys, but again you can skip all this, you can skip that boss fight actually a route I posted on my channel. Again, I'll link that in the video description too if you can't beat Rolana, but you want to look this good. It's quite simple because this is a, well, an armor set. You just come and pick up. So from here, guys, we are High Road Cross. When I make our way around to this right here, just I'm just going to do this just in case people ain't got this unlocked. So from the grace, we're just going to go right just this way. I mean, there's so many cool things to find in this game, and I just keep getting better and better. I mean, I found some badass things already. Um, I got some badass weapons to showcase and bring you guys even further. And this is just one of them sets. So we're just going to quickly run to this grace. You can see it right there. Avoid all these enemies, people. You don't want to mess with them. They will kick your ass. Okay, so this is the Morph Ruins Grace. Uh, so you can see where we're at on the map. No, it's not going to let me because I can't get off my stallion for some weird reason. Okay, so rest here. And come out of that. And you can see we're right there, guys. So this is like a little shortcut, a little secret path that we're going to go on. So pull up your stallion again and you want to come this way. Just like so. Now ignore the enemies. And you want to come to your left here. Just like so. And then, guys, you want to come this way. It's a little a little path you can take down here. See how sneaky that is? We want to come all the way down to the very bottom. So come down this way. Just like so. And let me actually put on my lantern. So I've got a little bit of light in here. Okay, so you want to come down here again. And jump down this way. Watch the... Uh, enemies behind you and then you want to come through this way just like so so very cool indeed now we're going to jump out here and we're going to be in the village which I cannot remember the name of it I'm so tired guys I've played this night and day since it's been released uh, but they tell me as soon as we get to the top of this come on move that ass move that ass come on move that ass <laughs> Bloody how deep is this? Jesus Louise. Okay, we're almost at the top. Okay, so now we're at the top. Is it Bonnie Village? 
It is Bunny Village. I remember when I got to the top. So you can see where we're at, guys. Right here. Now we're going to make our way across here. We're going to end up in that Bunny Jail. Cool. So I jump on, yes, dude. And come this way. There's ads here as well, guys. So you want to be careful of them. Jump over here. It's probably a bit quicker. And come this way. And I've got an itchy nose. Uh, scratch that. <laughs> okay, so I cross this bridge. And this is all you gotta do, people. This is all you gotta do. And again, like I said, this armor set's just sitting here, ready for you to pick up. Uh, along with the shield, too. There may be one or two ads in the way you may have to take out. Oh, shit, scorpions. Well, you, it's so easy. So you want to come inside here, guys. And you'll get kicked off your horse. And make your way down. And you want to access the Barney Jail Grace. Which is right here. Cool. Now, guys, we go a little deeper. We go a little deeper. And there's actually a hidden path here, which we have to take. So they ain't just lying around in plain sight. You actually have to take a hidden path to get these. Okay, so ignore this enemy's going to spit at you. You want to try and dodge out the way of that. Just like so. There's going to be enemies on your right there as well, which would lunge out at you. So yeah, avoid them. Come through this way. There's a guy going to try and chase you. you jump down this hole. And just like so. Now come down here. And then, uh, you see them things on the ceiling. They're going to jump down in there. You want to take a sharp left. Just like that. Just like that. Now avoid all these because they're quite hard. They latch onto you to take almost all your health off, which is a bit of a pain in the ass. So now, guys, we're going to jump down here. And then we're going to come this way. Let's keep following this path, people. Yeah, that big old pot man hits hard too. Try and avoid him. And then we're going to go through here. Just like so. Go left. I'm not sure where he's going, but yeah. Uh, keep running this way, people. And then we want to come down here and through this little entrance. And this gate will be locked. Well, it won't be locked, but you just have to open it. And then follow this path around. And then, guys, you want to jump on this little platform here. Now, this is where the secret happens. Instead of jumping off, just stay on it. Just stay on this. And you'll see it will go back up. And it will go above the original platform we jumped on. And it will go up. And you'll see, guys, that this armor is sitting right on this. Well, where that guy has been executed by the looks of it. But yeah, there's the armor. Now, if you come up these steps, guys, there's going to be an enemy right by this door. Take him out. And right behind him. There will be that shield. And it really is as simple as that, guys. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. And hopefully, guys, I will see you on that next one.